So when I first saw this Dragon Ball Z game, right? It's 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 amazing that this actually happened. I didn't know anything about this game. I didn't know that it was like it even had a chance to be a thing. But one thing that I've been thinking recently is that it's been a long time since we had a good 2D like just straight up Dragon Ball Z fighting game. And then all of a sudden Dragon Ball Fighters or Fighters. I don't know if they wanted to I don't know if they're trying to be like hip or something and it's supposed to be Fighters so they put a Z at the end or it's supposed to be Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Like I I assume it's supposed to be Fighters even though that's lame. And they just trying to be like cool and whatnot cuz Dragon Ball Fighter Z sounds even worse than Dragon Ball Fighters. But whatever, that's beyond that's like that's besides the point. The point is is that Dragon Ball Fighter Z whatever is supposed to be like it it was announced at the Microsoft E3 press conference thing and let me just let me just play the video and like I would talk as I don't want to hold y'all away from the video any longer because me personally I love Dragon Ball Z and I was pretty hyped for this gameplay footage you know a new experience so, so the thing about this Dragon Ball Z game it's made by the people who made Guilty Gear and I heard I hear nothing but good things about Guilty, Guilty Gear games, so I'm expecting some great gameplay. Oof! Like, do you not? Are you y'all watching this? Three v three gameplay. Think of Marvel vs. Capcom with Dragon Ball Z characters. You always was dreaming, yo, I wish Goku was in a Marvel vs. Capcom type game. I'm sure people probably didn't dream that. I'm sure people people probably didn't even know they wanted that. But now you know you wanted it because you see it. Now you're like, I gotta have it. That's what they did. They made a Dragon Ball Z game. With you. Like, like, I wanted to buy this game. Like, look at it, Marvel vs. Capcom combos in Dragon Ball Z gameplay. Yo, look at this. He turned Goku into a... Oh, you got Golden Frieza! What? Like, I already knew all of this because I watched the game. But, like, even seeing it, even though I knew all of this was in the game, I'm legitimately hyped just seeing all of this. I'm upset. Like, you got Dragon Ball Z. You got... You got Golden Frieza, but where's Blue Goku? Let me just let me just keep wandering it. Just we gonna keep seeing this. We gonna keep. We just gonna let's bring it back again. This is amazing. This is amazing. I always. I can't say I always wanted a good 2D, but like this is the type of this is what I always like seeing at E3. There are certain games that you didn't know you had to have until you seen them, until you, like you first saw them at E3. This is one of those type of games. I didn't know how bad I wanted a game like this until I saw it. I'm probably gonna end up getting this game. It's probably gonna be on PC too. I'm probably gonna get it on PC. This is most likely not a Microsoft exclusive. I don't think Microsoft really... That's a different question. But I, ain't, that, I mean, a different topic. But this is... Let me, let me rewind it again. I love Dragon Ball Z. One thing that I was really hoping... Why is there just not a Shonen game with just... Like, like this. Like a Shonen Marvel vs. Capcom type game. Where you just played as a bunch of anime characters. One Piece, Bleach, Naruto, Dragon Ball Z, One Punch Man. Even though that's not really shonen, I'm pretty sure. But, like, just a bunch of anime in one game. And you just body people. That would be awesome. But, like, I'll, I'm not gonna be too greedy. I'll keep Dragon Ball Z. I'll be happy with this game. How hype are you guys? Like, if you if you hype for this game, let me get a sub. Let me get a like. Like, if you got a dislike, if you want to be a hater, do that too. But just be hyped for the game. Comment why you hype for the game, why you not hype for the game. Because this is one of the best games that Microsoft showed in their conference.
I'm not going to talk about the Microsoft conference yet. I'll do that tomorrow. For now, I'm going to just keep breaking down these gameplays and like reacting to letting you know how hype I am for these games that we see in that E3. I don't know what else to say. Like, it looked like it, it, it pretty much reminded me of Guilty Gear with Dragon Ball Z characters. Like, just the, just like the, the way things were drawn, the animations, the movement of the characters, it just seemed like Guilty Gear. I might actually play a Guilty Gear, like, since I want to play this. This has a closed beta, by the way, so look for the closed beta. And I might actually try to play a Guilty Gear game, just to see, like, the Guilty Gear play type just so I can get ready for this game but as far as I know Guilty Gear doesn't have 3v3 fighting as I said already subscribe to the channel for more E3 coverage like the video dislike the video whatever as long as you hype for this game I'm signing out peace